local school districts and making some major decisions regarding the upcoming school year. News Channel 6's Devin Johnson spoke with Columbia County's superintendent of schools and he shows us the school district's final return to school plan. Public schools in Columbia County are expected to start August 3rd, the start date that school leaders previously planned for. However, there are some changes to the return to school plan before teachers and students return to the classrooms. And because there is uh, appearing to be some increase in the spread of the virus, we improved our return to school plan to add that our middle and high school students and staff um, would, would be required to wear face coverings in certain environments. The Columbia County School Board voted to open up on time for traditional school. The learn from home model will either start August 10th or 17th, depending on the grade level. More than 4,500 students are electing the online option. Dr. Caraway says that means fewer students on the buses and in the buildings. And then we're taking other, uh, other actions, such as our board approved to buy ionization modules that go into our air conditioning units. Every air conditioning unit will have one of these, which will clean the air of things, not just dust particles and allergens, but virus. Many school districts in the area have decided to delay the start date of school. Dr. Caraway says she and her board members thought about that, but felt moving forward with starting school is the best move. Let's let teachers meet their children, uh, form those relationships with them, get to know them, so that if we have to go to a learn from home AB model or even a full full time learn from home model, there will be a relationship there. However, there is a plan B in place if COVID-19 cases in the area continue to surge. So some students would go to school on Monday, Wednesday, learn from home. Tuesday, Thursday, Friday. Others would come to school Tuesday, Thursday, learn from home the other three. And Fridays would be a learn from home day for all students to give our teachers time to properly re prepare lessons. The next step for the school district is to install ionization modules in every school. There's one already in Grotown High School. Dr. Sandra Caraway says it takes COVID-19 out of the air by 99.4%. And Evans, Devin Johnson, WJBF News Channel 6. The Trump administration.